Alright, welcome back to part 6, if I remember correctly, to Let's Play Donkey Kong Country Returns. It's a me, Nick, but I'm not going to copy paste that term. Because I'm original! Yeah! Because no one ever Let's Played Donkey Kong Country Returns before. Not even that guy. You all know who he is. My name is blah blah blah, but you knew that already. Yeah, that guy. So, it's actually been a couple of days since I record, but I'm not going to let that get in the way. If you haven't noticed already, uh, the thing about this level is it's waves. Now, there is a particular way to avoid them, and that is to and that is to hide behind these rocks. Now, what you want to do here is to get a K letter, grabs to spawn. You also want them to survive. Uh, that's not the easiest thing in the world to do. Right? Oh yeah. That was actually a really hard one. Oh! See you guys in a bit. Right, I'm back! As you saw there, uh, there was like one wall that breaks down uh, when it got hit. Oh god. Uh, see you guys. Right, as I tried to say, but it's gone out, uh, so I'm not going to say it. But I'm going to talk about this thing. If you hit here, this one will be up and protect you from the waves. Should also be careful there because it's a trap. I'm not going to check out if there's a secret there. I believe it is, but I don't want to risk it. Oh my god. Everything is so danger town here. It's really scary, to be honest. Uh, if I remember right. This is a mechanic. Oh wow. I'm a little bit snorty. Excuse me for that. Checkpoint! Yes! Uh, but uh, that's the uh, ship part thing. Uh, it will be a. Me it will have a different mechanic in the future of this level. So look forward to that. I should probably blow my nose before next episode. What do you guys think? And I died. I'm going to blow my nose now. Probably see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. I blew my nose a little bit. I don't know if it's enough to actually do something, but I'm gonna try to get this one. Oh yeah! Just like that and apparently I said oh yeah in a fucked up way. I have no idea because I already think my voice sounds fucked up, fucked up when I edit these videos. So, that's the thing. Oh, come on! I was hiding! <sighs> See you guys. Alright, well, welcome back. I'm going to hit the blah blah blah. And I'm not going to. Fuck! That's the problem with recording this when you use a timer. <sighs> Alright, welcome back. I actually managed to hit the timer this time, but that's mainly because I paused the game. That doesn't matter anymore! Fuck! 
Alright, welcome back once again. Let's see if we can do this correctly. Now, if you pop up from... Right, this was what I was talking about earlier. This shelter only protects you one time. And this is also something I talk about later. Uh, if, you, if you're here in the window area, you're going to get hit. And that's something you do want to avoid. You can easily get that piece by jumping on the fish thingy. Either way, let's finish this level. Just I've always spent enough time as it is in this episode on this level. I'm glad it's finally done. So annoying. I thought that World 2 wasn't gonna be a problem. Apparently I forgot about this level. It's really hard. I hate it. I love it. I can't make up my mind. Um, so... Uh, I'm probably going to make this a long episode. Uh, so we have time to finish up the world. Because I, I personally don't want to make a short uh, episode again or... If I would skip the boss level on this episode, this episode would be short, but we make the next episode short because I will only have the boss battle. If you guys remember that I told you guys, what I told you guys is that I want to keep each piece of the world to the world. So I don't want to finish up world, like World 2 and start off on World 3. Yeah, that, that sentence actually made, made sense. Uh, I didn't imagine it to make sen any sense, but apparently it did. I don't know why uh, I didn't imagine it to make any sense, but either way, it did. No! Ah! Ah! You guys. What the hell? Alright, welcome back. Let's see if we can get this tongue later now. Uh, yes! That wasn't so hard. Now, was it? Wasn't it? I know how you supposed to say that, but anyway. I did it. Pray for me. I don't know why I'm going out quiet, but why I'm. Yeah, why I'm getting all tired. Ah, can't talk anymore. Why I'm getting all quiet about. If you pull down these guys. You'll get a banana coin. I, I just freaking love banana coins. So amazing. Seriously, I think this let's play had a little bit of bad start, but I think I'm getting the hang of it. Hopefully. And I think you guys enjoy it too. I'm learning to find a balance between commenting about the game and find, finding something else to comment about. That's it. That's a great combination! The reason why I sounded a little bit angry was probably not because I missed that, but because my mic felt over. Now, I got distracted and missed the piece. See you guys in a bit. Alright, welcome back. Let's get this piece correctly. Yay! I remember that Sultan. I think he was in another Donkey Kong game. No! Oh! He was in the intro of the game. If you go back to part one and see the intro, you'll see him. Oh my god! I've never realized that before. <sighs> uh, 
and I've already died. Bye. Alright, welcome back. I actually I forgotten where I died, so I'm starting to commentate here. I'm sorry if I died longer into the episode. I don't recall doing that. I actually being I died at the right point. But if you shake there, he will uh, blow up water, and that's how we get that puzzle beat. Let's finish up up this level and and then let's take down the boss. I'm just going to pause a little bit for returning, mainly because there's something I want to do. And also, bonus level. First time unlocking that. Nice. Alright, let's finish up this level by beating the boss, alright? Alright, loading screens, yay! Right, it's both called the uh, Scurvy Crew. Scurvy, yeah, Scurvy Crew. You defeat them like this. Then, yeah. If I remember correctly. Yeah, it's pro probably that I need to take a couple hits. Yeah. They jump on him. Here. I thought I was doing something wrong. Either way, they are possessed by the Maraca tip triplets. Which is a tiki. Yeah, a tiki. This is something that I never told you guys about in the first boss battle. These bosses are possessed by different tikis. That's the reason why they fight. Often they're just peaceful creatures. So that's something about the story that's different. If I remember correctly, from the first couple of games, they actually they had bosses that had reasons to fight you. These bosses just are possessed. That's something. I, I, I don't know how, how many hits are you going to take? I know you're talking wrong. Let's see. Alright. He just takes a lot of hits. This is. It's been a long time since I've played this boss battle. Right now, what you're supposed to do here is wait and then attack. Then you jump on all three of them. And that's how you're go gonna want to defeat the boss. I can't remember how many times you repeat that. But. That doesn't matter anymore because I'm replaying this level. <sighs> right. Let's see if. <sighs> Alright. So, after sucking horrible 
at this boss battle, something I have noticed that you want to hit your target from a far away distance. That will more, more or less guarantee that they turn over. Maybe I'm just lucky. Who knows? Because the only things I can think of is being lucky or hitting them far away. I can take this heart and uh, didn't have time to hit him, but either way, we'll have time to hit him now. Seems that. Yeah. It seems like uh, that's the way you should do it. Because so far, I've only. only been able to not do it. Well, that's the end of this boss. Apparently they thought it was great that they didn't the sound before they are defeated. Now oh, let's beat him up! Donkey Kong style! Every time I do that, my mic falls over. But that's probably because I shake my rear mode and nunchuck that much. Either way, let's have a look at the next level before we finish off this episode. Ruins! Looks nice. See you guys next episode.